Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. It's me, Sarah, and today we are back with another review. And our review today will be on the new Fenty Beauty um, eyebrow pencil that I recently got. So if you guys don't know, eyebrows are very important, you guys. Like, it's just like make a huge difference. Like, it can make it can just bring your makeup to a whole new level when your eyebrows just look like absolutely perfect. I, I love eyebrows like I love doing my eyebrows even though I like I have pretty decent eyebrows already but I do like to make it look really sharp really like I just like to make it look stand out a little bit I like to that sharp look um, but I can always do like a really soft look just just so you know just make it a little bit more fuller a little bit more darker so today I will also try it on for you guys and compare it to one of my all-time favorite eyebrow pencil that I used to use all the time but I'm running low on it that's the reason why I bought this new one to try it so we will do a comparison for the, those two so just stick with me we're gonna jump right into it okay you guys so this is my old eyebrow pencil this is from the um, benefit cosmetic brow pencil it's called a precisely my brow pencil I really need to talk slower like I talk so fast I don't even know why but I do but I'm gonna try to slow it down for you guys um, let me start over <laughs> So, my old eyebrow pencil is the Benefit Cosmetic Eyebrow Pencil. It is the Precisely My Brow Pencil. It's in the shade number 5, so I think this is their darkest shade in their eyebrow line. And I love it. Like, it's retractable. Also retractable, and it comes with a double N. This is the spoolie, and this is what it looks like. Yeah, I was using this for a very long time. I love this um, eyebrow pencil. This one, I usually do a, use the eyebrow pencil when I'm going for a softer look. When I'm just trying to fill in some of my eyebrows that like just a couple strand or something and just do like a very natural eyebrow look. So this is my go-to. So this is like all the way at the top and I am running out. Like this is, <laughs> I mean I can still use it but it's really at this end of its life. And this is the new Fenty Beauty. So this is the new Fenty Beauty eyebrow pencil. This is the packaging. It's white and it has this little black strip right here. It's also a double-ended eyebrow pencil. And this is in a shade deep, deep black. This is their darkest shade they got. I have pretty dark eyebrows, so I always go for the darkest shade in um on the eyebrow line. And it's also retractable. Alright, so this is this one's from Benefit Cosmetic and this one is from Fenty Beauty. So the Fenty Beauty is definitely more dark. It's actually a black. The other one is more of a darker brown. But yeah, so I got the deepest one on the Fenty Beauty line, which is the deep black. And today I'm going to try it out. So this is what it looks like. This side is retractable. You can, you know, pull it out twist it back and this what's interesting about this eyebrow um, pencil is that it's it's blending brush like the, your typical eyebrow pencil usually comes with a spoolie for you to blend it and I mean I never had a problem with it I blend it out it works it's you know it's a standard um, spoolie but this one is actually a brush like do you see that it's so weird let me try to blend it out on my hand so yeah it definitely does blend out so I try to blend out this part and you guys can see like it's like pretty blend out. It's not as that harsh line like um, when I first drew it on there. So I'm excited to see how this would look. Okay, let me try to do my eyebrows. Okay, so immediately I noticed that it does not draw on as smooth compared to my Benefit Cosmetic. With my Benefit Cosmetic, I can just draw like a straight line without it getting stopping or getting caught or, you know, just like, I don't know, it's like, it just go on so smooth and this one is not doing that. Like, it's giving you this weird, like, like it's getting caught onto something and it's stopping and it won't go on as smooth, like a straight line. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you're drawing it on and you're feeling like, so that's weird. Okay, now it's time to blend it out. Let's see. Okay, yeah, so I just got done blending out this side and filling it in with the Fenty Beauty eyebrow pencil. And I gotta say, I mean, I like the shade for sure. It does match my eyebrows. I like it. It's dark, it's pigmented. Um, the only thing I didn't really like about it is that it did not draw on as smooth 
as I would like it to be. Like, I feel like it was getting caught in nothing, really. Like, I tried to do a straight line, and I couldn't because it kept, like, stopping and keep getting caught. So I didn't like how that was, like, th 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 I didn't like that. Um, I tried to blend it out. I like how it blend out in the front where there is hair. But when I get closer to the end and I try to end, blend out the tail, it kind of just look like it's smudge. You know what I mean? Kind of give you that smudge look. So that's the only thing that I don't like about that. I don't like how it's drawn on. But like when I blend out the like underneath my eyebrows where there is the hair, I kind of like blend it up and it kind you know, it turned out really good. I like how that that was. But I'm going to go ahead and do this side with the Benefit Cosmetic um, I brought pencils so I can compare the two for you guys. So, be right back. So, I just got done with filling in the other side with the Benefit Cosmetic. I brought pencil and I mean, they both look pretty good. Yeah, so I blend them out and I kind of did the, everything the same thing. Um, I didn't really have trouble with this one drawing like a straight line. Like, it didn't get seem like it was getting caught on to nothing. It just go on really smooth and it blends out really good. I like the spoolie. I do. This one, I like the brush. Um, it's different, but I don't know how I feel. Like, I mean, it's a pretty good brush to blend out. But like I was telling you guys, when I was blending it out, like the part in front right here where there was hair, it's good. But when I get down to the tail and I kind of extend it past my hair, it looks, it gives you that little smudge look. And I don't really like that. So tell me what you guys think. Which side do you guys like better? This side, is the, this is the right side, which is the Fenty Beauty. And this is the right side, which is the Benefit Cosmetic eyebrow pencil um I don't know like I personally like I like them both like shade wise I like them both but applying wise and blending them out wise I have to go with my benefit cosmetic one like I really like the way this is it's so easy to apply it's so smooth to put on and it just blends out good without giving you that smudge look but I mean it's that that's an easy fix really because I can just use this one and then use a spoolie any spoolie really to just bend, blend it out if I have to so it really doesn't matter because I really do like the shade on this um, on Fenty Beauty besides that like I really don't have an issue with it so this Fenty Beauty comes in 14 shade this is their very first eyebrow pencil so it is also waterproof smudge proof and transfer free so I will update you guys on that after tonight because I'm actually heading out to go see it so I'm gonna finish my makeup and head on out so when I get back from the movies, I will update you guys. I'll see you guys in a couple hours, and I'll let you guys know my final thoughts. Hey guys, so I am back. I just went to the movies, and I saw it. It was long as shit. The movie was so freaking long, like ridiculously long. Every time we thought it was about to be over, it was not. But it was it was good, though. I mean, it had in moments. It was good. I think it was all right. Um, it wasn't too bad. I didn't read the book, so I wouldn't know is it did it live up to the book or not. But anyway, I just want to check in with you guys again to let you guys know how did it went. My eyebrows are still, both of them still intact. Like I literally wore two different eyebrows outside. So one side is much darker. Um, it's not by a lot, but it is darker than the other. You really can't tell unless you're like all in my face, and nobody should be all in my face anyway. Um, it's not that noticeable. But I do notice it. Um, it is a tad bit darker. But yeah, they both um, still stayed on pretty long. They both look good. Like, I don't have no complaints at all. They don't they haven't smudged. They haven't moved. And I didn't set... I don't usually do not set my eyebrows with any eyebrow show. So, I never had a problem with my eyebrows. So, yeah. So, I didn't feel like using it this time. Even though I do have some, but I want to try it how I normally would try it. And it still look good. Like I said before, I have no complaints with this new Fancy Beauty one besides the the brush, which I don't really care for because I don't think it, it makes much of a difference. And I don't know. I mean, it blends it out much more compared to the spoolie. This thing blends out much faster than the spoolie does, but it does give you that smudge look. Like, that's what I experienced. I felt like it gave me that smudge look. And I didn't really like it towards my tail. But, like, up here is fine because, you know, your hair is covering it anyway. So, I didn't really have a problem with the front. But when it comes to my tail, it did because it did give you that smudge look that I did not like at all. And the other thing is that I didn't like when I apply it, it doesn't go on as smoothly. Like I said, it's like... Th 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 like even though I'm trying to go in a straight line, it doesn't go on as smoothly as the Benefit Cosmetic one. So I did not like that. 
um, even though it does blends out into a very natural if you're going for a very natural look it can blend out to be a very natural look but overall like the pigmentation of the um, of the pencil was great much proof still looking good like my eyebrows are still looking on fleek and I forgot to mention that it is $20 this one actually have 14 shades and only for $20 so that's a really good price for a variety of shades okay so anyway I think the Benefit Cosmetic does not have I think they have like about maybe 10 shades I could be wrong I will leave in, in the description box more detail about that but um it is $24 so it is $4 more compared to the Fenty Beauty one so that's what I think about the Fenty Beauty I hope that it is helpful to you guys who are trying to like you know find a new brow pencil or to find something to start off with overall I think it's a good product like all the problem that I didn't like about it is easy fix it's not that major that's about it for today you guys I hope you guys enjoyed the video and hope you guys find it helpful um, if you guys are trying to look for a new eyebrow pencil so yeah give me a thumbs up if you guys like this video and leave it a comment what um if you guys have tried it and did you guys like it or not and if you haven't subscribed do subscribe down below and that's it for tonight you guys bye i will see you guys next time i'm gonna try to be more consistent i know i say that in every single video i know but i will try much harder now um to give you guys more more videos so just stay with me and we'll be back next time Bye, you guys.